Have you ever tried to break a Lego piece in half? It is a very difficult thing to do and it's impossible for most people to do because you're kind of holding yourself back. But what if I told you there's actually a very easy way to break Lego? I don't know why you'd ever want to, but there is actually a very easy way. And that is build with brown bricks. Lego brown bricks are the most infuriating thing to me because they break with the slightest touch. A couple months ago, I was building a Lego Mustafar mock and two of these four x four brown plates broke just from me trying to put the set together in a very normal, non-aggressive way. As you can see, I've broken a lot of brown bricks over the years, and it's actually very easy to do, as you can see by my demonstration. Now, this is not just a problem I have. This is a very universal problem, and LEGO fans have been complaining about it for a long time. But why are these brown bricks very breakable? Well, there's actually a reason for this, and LEGO has addressed it. It turns out that the dye they use in making the brown bricks, when combined with the ABS plastic used in all LEGO bricks, you get a very brittle LEGO piece. And this is not only the case with brown bricks. Dark red bricks are also very easy to break. I'm not gonna do a demonstration on these because these are a lot rarer than brown bricks. But like I said, LEGO has actually addressed this. And in 2018, LEGO changed the dye formula to make the brown bricks less brittle. So it's really only a problem when you're building older sets. And that's kind of sad because there's some really good sets from before 2018 that I would love to build, but it's just way too risky. Some examples of this are the UCS Sandcrawler, an MTT, the V19 Torrent, because this set has so much dark red on it. Oh my gosh, that would break so fast. And the worst one of them all, the Ewok Village. All these sets would be a nightmare to build, and I actually do have the Ewok Village, and I'm trying to build it right now without breaking any pieces. The ultimate challenge. And LEGO also gets much more brittle with age, so old brown bricks, not a good thing. But overall, it's really great LEGO has actually addressed this, and they have changed their formula. Just be really careful when building old brown LEGO sets. Man, I don't know how I'm ever going to finish this.